Hello, my name is Matt Baker and I'm superintendent at Walton Verona Independent Schools. I would like to begin today by thanking everyone for a successful start to our school year. I very much appreciate uh, all of our employees for the hard work this summer to prepare for opening a school year uh, virtually, which is something none of us have ever done before. I would also like to thank our parents and our students uh, for their patience, their cooperation, their communication uh, as we try to maximize the opportunities for our students during these unprecedented times. Parents, you've probably begun to see and receive communication from your child's school regarding MAP testing or Ames Web testing at the elementary school. Uh, this is testing we do on a routine basis in our school district to assess where your students are, to determine where they need extra help and where they are excelling. Uh, this year more than ever before. That data is going to be critical uh, in, as we try to assess uh, where your students are academically so that we can tailor our instructional processes to meet your child's needs. Each of our schools is conducting this testing a little bit differently depending on the age of the students. For example, uh, our younger students uh, seem to perform much better and we get more accurate data when those tests are performed in person. However, some of our older students uh, may be able to complete these assessments from home. Uh, but please understand and please try to stress to your children that more than ever before, this data is critically important uh, for us to assess where your students are so that we can meet their needs. The second thing I would like to discuss with you today is a pop-up testing event we are hosting on September the 5th, Saturday, September the 5th, from 12 to 7 in our high school parking lot. Our school district has partnered with Ethos Laboratories to offer COVID testing for all staff, all students, and all community members. Uh, this test is a minimally invasive nasal swab. You would receive the results within three days and comes with no out-of-pocket cost to you. It's covered by health insurance, and if you do not have health insurance, Ethos can receive funding from the government. So this is no, there is no out-of-pocket cost to, to anyone who chooses to take the test. I'll be sharing a flyer with you today through Infinite Campus Messenger. We'll also be sharing that on social media so that you can schedule your event. It is a drive-through event, uh, so you can be in and out pretty quickly and get your results within three days. One of the reasons we are doing this is that it has come to light recently that there are significant problems with data management on infection and positivity rates at the state level. In order to make good decisions about whether or not we should return to school in person and when that should occur, I need accurate data. This pop-up testing event is just the beginning of our efforts to obtain the most accurate data about infection and positivity rates in our district and in our community. I very much want to see students back in our schools, but only if we can do it safely. In order to make that decision, I need current accurate data. So again, uh, this effort is just the beginning uh, of, our, of, of our approach to obtain as accurate data as we can. So again, this event will be on Saturday, September the 5th from 12 to 7 in our high school parking lot. It is open to all students, all staff, and any community members uh, who would like to be tested for the COVID-19 virus. Thank you. Have a good weekend.